Welcome to T Real TV Films. I'm your host, Tia Barr, and we are here with Miss Candy hey, Lee. Tia. Congratulations Thank on you. your album. This Thank is you your first much. single, and you're coming out to break it out in the industry. Absolutely. How do you feel tonight? I feel fabulous. I've been waiting for this day since I was two, so I'm ready. Since you were two years yeah, old, you knew years. you were going to be standing here right yeah, here, exactly. creating your magic. Yep. And tell me about growing up in Los Angeles and then heading to Europe and creating uh, music all over the world and the diversity of what's new in Los Angeles, being back in Los Angeles. Okay. Well, born in, born in Los Angeles, however, when I was 12, I moved to Europe. So I had an opportunity to go to German schools, and it taught me a lot about tenacity and commitment because I didn't speak the language. So I was able to perform all over radio and TV in Europe, which was really cool. How, how did you go to school without speaking the language? I mean, it's like, how did you get through with that on a day-to-day -day basis? And was music a big outlet in that part of your life? No, going to school? not necessarily. No, they don't, they don't have extracurricular activities. Wow. Yeah, so just tenacity. Tenacity, okay, let's talk about tenacity. Tenacity is what you got you here. What was your passion and drive behind the music industry and creating this album, Dirty Little Secret? Dirty Little Secret. Well, um, I am in a family that has three um, survivors of sexual assault. So it's near and dear to my heart. And my mom, that's okay. My mom inspired me to write it. And also watching the gymnasts that were, you know, assaulted by Dr. Nasser just disgusted me. And so I was waiting for my last song on my album and... Dirty Little Secret was born in like five minutes, and my mom is one of the co-writers as well. So so this is a dramatic song. This is something that's very oh, dear to yeah. your heart. My music is dramatic, for sure. Okay. Yes. It sounds like something that might be sexy right off the top, you know, Dirty Little Secret. but I know, right? The yeah. name is a little sexy. Tell me about your journey on inner healing, on dealing with such a heavy topic like this. Not, you know, there's a lot of people that can relate to what you've been through, and how can you help them um, with your music? Well, I think that's the whole purpose of the album is to help people, right? And I think you just have to take a stand on what's acceptable and what's not, and also never forget where you came from. Yeah. And be grateful for every day. Exactly. Let's talk about being grateful. Okay. Let's being in a state of gratitude. What does yes. that mean to you? Uh, stay grounded and never forget and be uh, look around even though there might be stuff happening to just be thankful for you know for life and for friends and for family and opportunity. Because that can be applied to both the music industry and real life. Absolutely. The music industry is real life. <laughs> And we're here in Hollywood. You're we're in Hollywood, right? <laughs> we're in Hollywood, so we can't be boring. And no. speaking of uh, not being boring, you, I heard you have a show coming out. I do. That you're working very hard I do. on. Very hard Tell on. Tell me it. about it. Okay. It's the Rise Up With Me television show, and it gave birth after my first day in the studio. I felt, speaking of gratitude, right? I felt such a sense of gratitude, and the music community accepted me, right? And I just felt a huge sense of responsibility that I had to give it back to artists. And I've, I've spent 20 years in the personal coaching business, right? And I've seen how powerful that is when you take yourself on and overcome fear and rejection. So that's a big part of the show. And we have about 55 music mentors here uh, in the show. Wow. And I think it's combined, I don't know, a thousand years of experience and they want to oh give back. A thousand and years of experience. Nobody gets eliminated. Wow. Right? I love that. That's about different. about community, yeah. right? Yeah. And it's going to be awesome, but it's about the contestants and not the people on the show. So how like, do you qualify to be on the show? You got to be really good, right? <laughs> you got to be really good, number one. Plus, but you also have to be the next global citizen. The so next global citizen. leadership. Okay, okay. Like wow, the next Bill okay, Gates, right? Leader. Okay, you're so be a for leader, the next leader. Next leader, and okay. of course, amazing performer, right? I'm but so excited for the show. And tell me the name of the show. It's called The Rise Up With Me TV Show. The Rise Up With Me TV Show. Rise Up With Me. I love that so much. So you are super busy. You have your music. Yep. You have your television show, yep. you're back in Los Angeles. How does that feel being back in Los Angeles after being in Europe after all this time? Well, I had a few um, segues, right? I lived in Nashville, I lived in Las Vegas, Arizona. So I, yeah, this is, this is home, right? Yes, and your family's here and you feel happy here. Yes, I do. And you're surrounded by all of your wonderful friends. Tell me who's here joining you at this amazing release party. Oh my gosh, I have so many. Uh, my mom, my dad, my future son-in-law, my daughter. I have some friends from Arizona and friends from Los Angeles, so. Your mom and dad, you are so know, blessed. Right? Right? Oh my gosh, what a blessing to be here celebrating your I release know. album. Congratulations, yeah, I cannot enjoy. wait to hear this song, Dirty Aww. Little Secret. And the album I dropped last night, actually, at midnight. I and mean, where can people find the album right Everywhere. now? Everywhere. Everywhere, okay, online. On retailers worldwide, yep. And let's let people know is actually, so it's Candy Lee. Candy Lee, Dirty Little Secret, and my social media is at real Candy Lee. And I want to talk to you about more, you have experience helping other people in the industry. Yeah. 
give me your like top five. You know, I'm coming to you. I'm having a hard time. You know, give me your top things that you would say to help. You know, help somebody. Have help them be anybody. successful. Yeah. Okay. So number one, it's really important who you surround yourself with, and you got to know uh, what your brand is and okay. never settle, right? Because you're gonna have a lot of people showing up in your career and in your life but never settle. So for example, this album took three years wow. because it had to be, you know, on point. And so never settle, know your brand, know who you are, and surround yourself with great people. And I don't forget that. gratitude. Gratitude. Right? Namaste. Namaste, for sure. <laughs> Aww. I love it. You're so awesome. You are so awesome. Congratulations you. on this wonderful achievement in your Thanks. journey. I can't wait to hear the next album that you come out with. I know, right? I'm excited to see what you're doing next. Thank so you. everybody, you have to keep an eye on Miss Candy Lee. And that's your website, I'm assuming, candylee.com? Yep, candylee.com, K-A-N-D-I-L-E-E.com, or Rise Up With Me TV show. Rise Up With Me. Rise Up With Us. I love it. Right? And so let's talk a little bit, just before we leave, about yeah. the Me Too. Um, yeah. This has a lot to do with like all the yep. movements that are going on. Yep. What does that personally mean to you? Well, I started my album three years ago before the hashtag Me Too and Time's Up was really popular, but it's my own personal Time's Up record. Yeah, because right? I think as women, and I can say this as a woman in the industry, we all felt it no matter oh, what. It was sure. obviously a subtext that was unspoken, and so now it's just it's rising so, to the it's top. It's so powerful. Yeah. It's so powerful. It's a revolutionary time in history for people, and specifically women. I mean, it's so exciting, I think. Well, maybe you can base your next album on that too as well. Right? We'll have to come up with a title. Maybe we can do a song together. Maybe a duo. Who knows? There you go. Let's do it. <laughs> I love it. Thank all right, you. beautiful. Well, thank you so much. And definitely keep your eye on the superstar and listen to all of her wonderful music. Thanks, Yeah. Okay. Bye. Thank you. I'm your host, Tia Barr. You're watching Real TV Films. Thanks for watching.